Kind, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day or night or afternoon, wherever it is that you are. Um, I'm going to read a piece of poetry called And Still the Escalation. And still the escalation throws mankind into a hole. And still the puppeteers try to reach their greedy goal. And still a world of violence puts the spirit in demand. He shall cleanse his holy planet from the ignorance of man. Make you ready for the coming as the dawning lights the path. Make you ready for the kindreds who shall walk the hallowed path. Leave no doorway for the heathen to slip out in hour of need, as the coming of his glory shall set forth thy spirit free. We are ready to adjoin you with the love that's fizzled out. Tis a moved misunderstanding, so no need to scream and shout. It's a must for all of brethren, as the old world has to die. But through death of old comes cry of new, under the clearest sky. In this life you have been tested as you knew you had to be. Tis a call for those progressing to the land beneath the seas. In the autumn we shall fill you with a grief and pure desire that shall light the light of purest soul amidst your darkest hour. So progress as time has taught you and take charge of what's ahead and leave not the light of love's own gaze. Love life, that's what you said. Take up the call and prosper on in times of hate and greed. Recompense all of your words so true. We'll see no harm comes to you. We'll set your spirit free. This is called Recluse. It's on a show. I sit me down as it is no use. I am now this lone recluse. Why no not I, for I am free. I am not that of which I used to be. That was short and sweet, wasn't it? <laughs> So, what's happening? What's happening, humankind, in your world? Is it turmoil? Or is it okay? Are we releasing? Are we here today? Or are we living in our tomorrows, focusing upon our dreams? Or are we living those nightmares of past? And are we listening to those screams? What we need to do as one is come together. We need to all come together, all of us. Stop the fighting, stop the bickering. It's not working. It's gone on and on and on for thousands of years. It's about time we called it a day. Because it's not working any longer. There is nothing to be learned anymore through pain and through suffering. Nothing. It's all been done. It's been done thousandfold. It's been done million for, billionfold. It's been done. It's over and done. It's time to wake up. It's time to forgive. It's time to let go of the past. I keep saying it and I will keep saying it until you get the message. We all will awaken in our own times as to what's occurring. 
both within and without. And that's the same what they use, isn't it? They. Who's they? They. They say. <laughs> it's a saying that they say. What do they say? I don't know what they say. Why am I going like that? I don't know. They tell me to do it. <laughs> uh, they say. What do they say? You see what I mean? I distract myself sometimes. I just go off on one. But we... Uh, we need to let go. We need to let go of our pasts for definite. And stop pointing the finger and saying it's your fault. It's not. We project on out into this world. It's related to the thoughts create. We project out into this world onto others that for which we need to learn about ourselves. So when you're pointing and you're saying you're a bully, you're a bully, you're a bully, or you are this, or you are that, well what we need to learn about ourselves it's what we need to release it's what we need to accept about ourselves because this is my opinion every video I'm going to say this is all only my opinion I'm not here to upset anybody I'm not here to you know it, not in any way shape or form if it resonates with you, then it resonates with you. If it doesn't, then it's not for you. It's, it's That's cool. It's Honestly, you're living your part. You're playing your part. You're living your life. It's good. I'm not trying to convince anybody of anything. I'm just putting my point of view across. That's all. You know. And my point of view at this moment in time is that the hatred... The falling out, the fighting, the pointing, the blaming. It's not working. It's not working. It's not working. It needs to be finished now. It needs to be stopped. All of humanity, all of humankind need to come together. We must come together now. Because that's the only way forward. We don't want to self-destruct. We don't want to, you know... There's nothing to be learned through the hatred anymore. There's nothing to for humankind to learn by humankind suffering any longer. Nothing. Nothing at all. So... Try something. Just try something different. You know? When you're on your way to work, if you're not in lockdown or whatever, just pay someone a compliment. Just, just, if you see someone, just pay them a compliment. You know? Good morning. You look, that's a nice coat you're wearing. You know? You look lovely, you know. Don't mean to say that you want to jump in sack with them, does it? <laughs> eh? Just try it. If everybody upon this planet paid someone a compliment on a daily basis, could you imagine the collective vibe? How high that would go up? One half. It won't have. You look nice in your mask. <laughs> oh, that's a nice skeleton's mask you've got on over there. It's very nice. Well, <laughs> you know. Oh, that's a very nice car you've got. That's a very nice bicycle you've got. Shame you've got a flat tyre. Would you like me to pump it up for you? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs>
Oh dear. No, do something. Do something. To... To help raise awareness. To help raise the vibe. Just try it. What have you got to lose? You know? What have you got to lose? Wouldn't it be nice if when you're having a shit day, when someone turns around and says something or does something? It's really nice. You know? Mm. Don't buy someone a coffee. You know? Total stranger. That'd be cool. Yeah, I've done that before. Yeah. It's nice. It's a nice feeling. You know. Anyway. Um, it's a wonderful thing. I'm going to tell you a story, actually. About... Uh, about this... Wonderful chap. I don't, don't know his name. I was on holiday and it was a Scottish chap. And it was laid by the pool and he had no legs from the knees down. And I was with my then, I don't, I don't think we were married then, but my partner then of a long, many years. And <clears throat> he was with his wife and sister, I believe. And... Uh, I got to we we got I got talking to them you know we got talking to to these lovely Scottish people and um, he said oh I'd I'd love to uh, when I'm back at home he said I, I go swimming I wish I could get in here I said why why is it because it's cold and he said no no I said I just I have someone who helps me you see when I'm when I go swimming at home. So I said, all right. I said, well, I'll, I'll help you. And he looked and he went, would you? I said, of course I would. Yeah. I said, I'll go get my shorts on and I'll come back down. And, and, and he's like, oh, thank you so much. And his, and his sister and his, his wife are going, oh, that's so kind of you. And it's, and it's no biggie, is it? You know. So I went and I put my shorts on and I came back down. And they were laid on, on the, the sunbed. Anyway, um, I said, uh, he, he said, I'll, I think he said he, he would shuffle across on his backside to the water's edge. And I said, oh, it's all right. <laughs> I said, no, I said, I'll, I'll drag the, um, the bed, just stay on the bed and I'll drag you over to, <laughs> to the side of the pool. <laughs> Well, I dragged that bloody bed straight over my big toe and my big toenail just went... <laughs> and it, <laughs> it stood up like that. <laughs> and his wife and sister's going, Oh, look at what he's done to his big toenail. And I'm going... <laughs> and my toenail stuck up like that and he's going... Oh, no, are you all right? And I'm going, oh, it's all right. I said, it's nothing. It's just my big toe now. So I pushed it and I pushed it down. I pushed I pushed it down. So it was like, I pushed it down and I've got my finger pushing on it like that. And I've got I've got my, my finger underneath and I'm holding the nail and I'm squeezing it. I'm squeezing it. So it says, my thumb, my thumb, I'm squeezing it that much. My thumb's as red as this bandana. So um, they're going, Oh my God! And you know, and I'm saying, no, it's all right. It's it's honestly, it's fine. It's honestly, I'll just go back to the room. I'll put some some tape round it, and then what I'll do is I'll come back down, and you can have your swim. And I, oh, are you sure? And I, I say, of course I am. I of course I am. It's, it's it's not a bother, honestly. It'll knit together. And these poor women were <laughs> beside themselves. So. Myself and my partner, I'm, I'm walking away, I'm trying not to hobble. <laughs> and myself and my partner are walking, and as soon as I got round the corner, she, she grabbed hold of my hand, she went, Stephen, are you all right? And I just went, <gasps> and I, I swore. <laughs> I won't tell you what I said, but I swore. Anyway, I went up to Rome and I put some plaster around it and I came back down. And when I got there, and they're like, oh my God, are you? I know, it's fine, honestly, honestly. 
So I got in the water and it, it you know, it, it got itself in. And he said, if you just support my head, so I supported his head and, and, he, and he swam and he kicked his legs. It was very cold. It was very cold. But he got his swim. He got his swim. And what one thing that I did forget to mention was when I got round the corner and my partner said, oh my God, are you all right? I said, of course I'm all right. There's a guy there with no legs from the knees down. And all I've done is just put my toenail up. Of course I'm all right. I've not lost my legs, have I? So, you know, we can do little things that help others you know and by doing those little things we can make this world a better place to live for everybody and we all are equal we all are equal don't you let this illusion of 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 this reality don't you let this illusion fool you into thinking that you are any better or any lower than any other human being upon this planet because you're not you are all worthy of an abundant life and you will get it. I'll do me down this to help you. I will. And, and by doing this, by doing this. So get out there, help somebody, pay someone a compliment and see how you feel. Anyway, thanks for listening. If you'd like to donate to the channel, there's a link below. Thank you very much, if you've already done so. If you would like to subscribe, then please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up, or a thumbs down, it makes noise, or whatever. If it resonates with you, thumbs up would be good. If it do not that's cool. It's all right. Anyway, have a wonderful, wonderful day, evening, or afternoon, or night, wherever you are. And... Uh, do something good. Do something good. See how it makes you feel. Bye for now.